practice today, and uh, you know, uh, probably sound like a little bit like a broken record, but they've been very focused, and um, you know, they had a lot of energy again today. We went full pads again today, and uh, I thought they got a lot out of it. And uh, again, we need a lot of, we still need a lot of practice, but uh, I think they're working in the right direction. Coach, what are your biggest concerns when you look at Virginia on film? Well, uh, defensively, they're very sound. They're very sound and very solid, you know, and uh, they're probably in the top three or four in the league in, you know, most categories defensively. Uh, just because they play hard and they're physical, uh, you can tell that's been uh, obviously imparted to them and, and the importance of it. Offensively, uh, you know, they're really tough to defend because they, you know, there are so many motions and shifts and trades and they kind of get you out of sorts. Uh, you know, in terms of alignments. Mm -hmm. uh, but, um, you know, again, they got some good personnel too. Very, very big physical offensive line. Uh, and they got some uh, really, really good running backs that know how to run downhill and, and be very physical and have good vision and can make great cuts. So, uh, very good scheme. Uh, throwing the ball down the field, they're good at that. So, um, you know, overall, they, uh, they're, they're, they're a good, very good football team. Is this game more about this year or is it also more of maybe an audition for next year? I think it's a little bit of both. I mean, you know, obviously you want to win in, in your year with a win. And, uh, you know, so this is an opportunity for us to do that. Uh, and then the momentum that, can, that it can give you uh, as far as it propelling you into the next season, you know, that's, that's big too. And uh, we know two years ago that certainly helped us when we won the Outback Bowl. But uh, I don't think it's a deal breaker on, you know, what, what that means for your next season, but it certainly gives you momentum going in. Can, it, can a young guy basically, I don't want to say earn a starting spot, obviously spring and fall camp's big, but can he make a, a huge statement forward maybe towards next year being a starter? Yeah, I don't think there's any question. You know, young guys out here, this is kind of their pre-spring practice, if you will. So, uh, you know, we expect them to come out here and be further along than they were four weeks ago. You know, mm -hmm. they've got a rest, time to, some, you know, time to, you know, kind of get away from football and then take it all back in, and it's their second time doing it. So, um, I think a lot of our young guys are really, uh, you know, they're getting better out here at these practices. The the room temperature in here for game time is going to be a lot warmer. Do you wish they would turn the heat up a little bit to get you guys acclimated to that? Um, you know, that would be fine. I uh, haven't really thought much about it. You know, we know that we played in here before, and we know that it will be warm with all the people in here. So uh, it's sold out again. So um, you know, we just got to play whatever the temperature is. Just talk about the importance of special teams and ball games. With so much time off that comes up. It really does, you know, and that's that's a little worrisome because you know that's where you see, um, you know, that's where you see some things happen that um, you know that normally don't happen. You, know, you see block punts, you see return kicks for touchdowns, you see, uh, you know, and I don't know why that is, you know, but it's certainly a worry. You know, I was watching the whole game the other day and suddenly missed block the kick, you know, and um, uh, in the championship game I think it was against Houston, but um, you know you do worry about that. So you got to really, really be up on your special teams. And as we know, our special teams have really been you know, something that we've, we've had to rely on for field position. So we're, we're taking a lot of, a lot of time with that. Gene, you're uh, uh, after, after such a big layoff, you get back to game speed. Well, I think it takes them. You know, I think you, you got to be, you know, into the first few series to you really you know, understand true, the true game speed. We're trying to go against each other enough out here uh, we're not getting so much away from game speed, which can only do that so much, especially with the limited number of players that we have. So, um, you know, game speed usually is kind of, you know, you kind of get back into that after the third or fourth series, and you're, and you're used to the tempo of the game. Are you going to use that to your advantage uh, on offense? If their uh, defense is not at game speed, can you look for a big play uh, on the offensive series? I mean, you know, yes, I guess so. Um, you know, we're going to do what we do on offense. And we're not going to change that. Gene, your uh, you know, seniors are small in number, obviously, but you've gotten some good contributions from those guys. Can you sense as you look at them that, that they realize that this is it, that this winding down? I think so. You know, I think they understand that this is this is the final the final shot. You know, and uh, you know, I'm sure a lot of them have aspirations to go on, but the reality of it is, we know that there won't be many that are able to do that. So um, we want them to go out with on a, on a great note, obviously. Yeah, El Toro looked like he was ready to play yesterday. Yeah. El Toro's been doing a really good job. I'm very proud of him. Gene, change the subject from the bowl. Or even you a little bit surprised by what Cam has accomplished as a rookie in the NFL? No. I'm not surprised. I, that's what, I mean, anybody that wanted my opinion last year, that's the opinion I, I gave him. He's a star. And anybody that thought differently, 
everybody's got their own opinion, but I was around them every day, I watched them every day, and I'm not one bit surprised. And again, as the years go on, and he uh, learns more about the league and you know learns uh, more about the defenses, uh, you're going to see more of the same. Anything else? Thanks, Thanks Coach. Thank you.